What are the main treatment techniques in Ayurveda? Now, the first philosophy is that anything can be a treatment that gets you better, right? You know when sometimes you're down and you're not feeling well, and then suddenly you eat something nice and you have a nice conversation, you feel better. That can be treatment too. So in Ayurvedic medicine, we use absolutely everything to treat you with. But there are some specific things. There's one thing called pancha karma. Pancha means five, and it's the five cleanings of the body. So we do things like vomiting. It's very therapeutic. I know some people find it controversial, but for thousands of years, people have been doing these things. And yogis have been taking care of their body and their mind too. And of course, the spirit is there. So the other thing is purgation, where we take strong herbs and we go to the bathroom. So we eliminating out of all the orifices of the body uh, because they a need cleaning, but they are the passageways. For example, like the nose is the passageway to the head, so it needs cleaning. Nasya is a very powerful tool that we use. It's another cleansing method. And then we have other cleansings of the ears and the eyes and the nose and the mouth, all of the other orifices as well. And then we take herbs inside. That's another way of treatment. And then there's herbs on the outside, many different oils we use, and we treat the body in that way too. There's one very famous one, which is oil on the forehead, goes backwards and forwards, and it's kind of mesmerizing to the mind, but it's so calming that the mind calms down. And if your mind calms down, then your body is calm, peaceful, and it has a chance to go through a healing method.